Hello again guys, welcome to Mystic Death. I'm Bobby, the lead 3D artist of Alan Sharp, White Toilet Plague and many other low-poly video games I've worked for clients doing work as a freelancer over the internet. I'm also the digital marketing specialist of UX Labs. Well, today I'm going to talk about a very interesting topic. Uh, I can say that, honestly, this wasn't like part of the plan for recording devlogs, but I, when I experienced it, when I read it, I was so amazed by, by the theme and, uh, and when I read the comments and uh, the opinions of other indie game devs, I thought it would be a material worth sharing in a devlog. So recently I posted a tweet on Twitter which I can say got quite a lot of engagement and attention. Uh, there were a lot of people who liked it, who retweeted it, and many others who promoted their games on my tweet. So they self-promoted. What do you think about it? So you guys who shared your games in my tweet, I'm very proud of you guys. I'm very proud of you. Why is that? Because that's the only thing that the indie game scene requires at this moment. There are a lot of indie game deaths which I discussed with and they were in a way ashamed or uncertain. They didn't want to do self-promotion and so on and so on. And if we can see on the internet, that's the main reason why indie games, why not a lot of indie games succeed in the world. Because they don't, do not have marketing. And what you did there, when you promoted and when you shared your game on my tweet, that's one of the best de decisions you could ever make. I'd love all those games, I'd love to see them be released. And I'm very pleased that you shared your game with me. So, the, in a way, that's, that's a promotion. That's marketing, guys. So, do not be ashamed. It is your product. Remember, when you started working on your game, you worked with passion. You dedicated your time. You, you did a lot of hard work, learned a lot, studied a lot of different topics. And that needs to be seen. That the world needs to see your product. So, do not be ashamed. I'm very glad that you wrote it like a reply on my tweet. And let's see what a very popular entrepreneur says about self-promotion. Let's check Mr. Arnold Schwarzenegger. Work like hell, go to bed, and early, early to rise, work like hell and advertise. So you work your ass off, and then you let the world know about your work. That's what it is all about. Let people know if you have a company, if you have a movie, if you do a sports. Work your ass off, but then advertise and let everyone know. That's right, Arnold. That's right. You need, whatever you do, you need to promote yourself. So do not be ashamed or worried about self-promotion. Whenever possible, promote your game. Uh, there's a, let, let us check uh, another uh, thing on the internet I found. It was like an article. Uh, it's part of marketing and the article mentioned about the success of indie games and there was a certain paragraph that I read which said why many indie games do not succeed. Let's check it out guys. As you can see, even the article says a lot of indie games do not succeed because they have very little or no marketing at all. There are some who have some marketing, but it's usually quite bad. It's not the right approach towards your target audience, towards the, the press and so on. And that's the main reason why small indie games do not succeed. Yes, there are a lot of other reasons which can be discussed in another video, but as you can see, marketing is very important. So recently I also did a small poll which I was interested in and I wanted to see how other people see marketing on Twitter and I got the following results. Let's check it out. So as you can see here where, where I made this tweet, um, 
we can see that the numbers are quite divided. I'm quite satisfied with this result because more and more game, game developers see that marketing is uh, very important. As you can see, 30.8% uh, think that uh, they, they love digital marketing, which is great. Uh, others say, oh, it's okay, I guess, that's 346 which is a higher number. And 34.6%, the same number as the uh, it's okay, I guess, say I don't like marketing. So unfortunately, guys, marketing is a very important. It's not just in game development. Marketing, especially digital marketing nowadays, is very important about every business. You need to always have a strong digital presence. You need to always uh, stay ahead of competition, do a right strategy and so on and so on. So whether you like it or not, marketing is very necessary if you wish your game to succeed. Uh, when I started working in game development, primarily I'm an artist. I'm a 3D modeler. And throughout the years, I also entered into data analysis and digital marketing. And to be honest, after I dived into those waters, I, I can say that I simply love digital marketing. There are so many things you can do to promote your product, to contact people, and most of all, you, you socialize. You're building relationships with your customers. And that's a very, very good feeling. And regarding digital marketing, uh, there are, yes, it's, it's a huge, huge profession and a lot of things need to be learned. But once you get into them, you'll realize it's quite interesting and it, it is also very beneficial for your game. So one tip I could say to you guys is always start early with digital marketing. As soon as you have like a, the first playable prototype of your game. You don't need to have like a lot, a lot of art. You can, for example, start by sharing what you're working on. What is your idea? What are you doing? And as your game progresses, as, as you establish some good visuals, uh, some things like, which could be eye-catchy and amazing, like uh, images or GIFs, or is it GIF or GIF? I'm pretty sure it's GIF, uh, or videos, you can then share them on social medias, find your right target audience. And there's another tip, if you're, when you're building your digital marketing strategy, keep in mind that you're creating this game for particular target audience. For example, you're creating a first-person shooter game. Find people, find streamers who are playing first-person games. Game developers or um, RPG fans, they are not your target audience. So make sure you find the right audience. Like I said previously, I will do a whole video about marketing uh, a bit later, uh, which will include email marketing, uh, content writing, um, optimizing your Steam store page, a website, uh, uh, writing to YouTubers and so on. Uh, it's a broad topic and maybe it will be separated in several videos, but for now, I recorded this video just because I wanted to say Thank you guys. And I'm very proud that so many decided to do self-promotion on the tweet and share their project with me and with the rest of the people who commented on the tweet. Do not be ashamed of the word self-promotion. That is what is required in order your game to succeed. Whenever you find a possibility, whenever there's a chance to do self-promotion, go for it. Do not give up. So if you, if you guys love the content of this video, please click like and subscribe so we can grow an amazing community. Have a great day. Bye.